Hey guys, in this video, I'm going to show you how you can cast or mirror your Android phone screen on your Mac operating system. So let's get started and let's see how we can do this. So first of all, what we are going to do is we are going to use a tool called SCRCPY. Sometimes it's also called screen copy. So just open your favorite browser and search for SCRCPY. And the first link which will appear here will be from github.com forward slash Jenny mobile forward slash SCRCPY. So just uh, click on this link and it's going to open this GitHub repository. So when you scroll down here, you will be able to see uh, what this SCRCPY tool can do. Basically, this SCRCPY tool is an open source tool which enables you to control your Android device using USB and it works on uh, Linux, Windows and Mac OS operating system. When you further scroll down, you will be able to see how you can install screen copy on your Linux, Windows and Mac operating system. So for Mac operating system, you need to have Brew already installed on your system and using brew you will be able to install screen copy now if you don't know what is brew you can just click on this link which is home brew uh, and it's going to open this uh, website which says brew.sh and to install home brew you just need to copy this uh, code from here or you need to just copy this command from here and then open your terminal. You can open your terminal by just going to the spotlight and then search for the terminal. And once the terminal opens, you just need to paste this command. I already have Brew installed on my uh, Mac operating system. So I'm going to just uh, cancel this process. But if you don't have Brew, then just, uh, just run this command and Brew will be installed on your Mac operating system. Now, in order to check the version of Brew, you can just write Brew hyphen hyphen uh, version and then it's going to show you the version of Brew you have installed on your Mac operating system. Now, once you have Brew, we are ready to install Screen Copy, which is the main tool which we are going to use. So, this is the command to install on the same uh, GitHub page or where we can find the documentation of Screen Copy. So just write brew install scrcpy. So I'm going to just uh, clear the terminal and paste this command and press enter, which is going to install this tool. So now screen copy tool is installed on my Mac operating system using homebrew. It also says on this documentation that you need ADB uh, accessible from your path if you don't have it yet. So I'm going to just copy this command also and then uh, I'm going to paste uh, this command here. So let me clear the terminal, paste this command and it's going to install this Android platform tools also here. So just wait for some time again until this uh, tool is installed. So now the Android platform tools are also installed on our Mac operating system. So I'm going to clear the terminal and now we are ready to cast or mirror our Android phone on our Mac operating system. So now at this point, you just need to connect your Android phone using USB cable to your Mac operating system. And then you need to allow the access of your Android phone from your Mac operating system. And now you just need to run this command SCRCPY and then press enter, which is going to screen cast your Android phone on your Mac operating system. So you can see my Android phone screen is visible on my Mac operating system. Now, if you don't see this Android uh, screen on your Mac operating system after running this SCRCPY command, you might want to enable the debugging mode on your Android device. So for that, what you need to do is you just need to uh, go to the settings. So just click on settings uh, icon and then go at the very bottom where it says about phone. So just press this option which says about phone and then press 
on build number few times so i'm going to press on build number few times and it's going to uh, enable uh, the developer mode for you so when you go back you are going to see developer options will be enabled on your phone so you can just click on developer options and make sure that in the developer options this uh, developer option is enabled and also when you scroll down you will be able to see uh, these debugging options so make sure that usb debugging is enabled always prompt when connecting to usb is enabled and also allow adb debugging in charge only mode uh, is enabled okay so all these options under uh, debugging should be enabled in order to view your uh, phone screen on your mac operating system using scr cpy tool